political parties. I thank you very much. I pass the floor to advocates for human rights. Mr. President, the Advocates for Human Rights welcomes the report of the High Commissioner and thanks the Human Rights Council for its ongoing attention to the human rights situation in Cambodia. Cambodian human rights defenders, as well as Cambodians in diaspora in the U.S., have shared with the advocates their deep concerns about escalating efforts to silence opposition and shrink civic space in advance of national elections. Our concerns include, first, the narrowing of democratic space with arrests of opposition leaders, the dissolution of the main opposition party, and the banning of 118 senior party members, including parliamentarians, from political life. The National Assembly recently enacted amendments redistributing those seats and further tightening restrictions on voting rights and freedom of association. Second, the increasing intimidation, harassment, arrest, and detention of human rights defenders. Further, the government has closed, suspended, or deregistered civil society organizations. Third, the targeting of media outlets. Newspapers have been closed and radio licenses revoked, while individual journalists have been investigated and arrested on dubious charges. The Advocates for Human Rights calls on the Council to ask OHCHR to keep the situation in Cambodia under review and to consider appropriate action in advance of the national elections scheduled for July 2018. Thank you.